And when I make these videos and end them, I need to stop pretending as if you are actually watching me on a stream or something. Because it might not always be a minute to you guys. And once again, I suck at evading. Oh well. At least I'm not chasing down the stupid rat. That's the important thing. Because I don't mind fighting. It's just... When I was chasing down the stupid rat... I mean, heck, I knew what I was in for. I've played this game before. That stupid rat is just so good at evading you... That... Um, I knew the amount of battles I probably would have been in would have been crazy. Oh, hello. Oh no, that's a good form right there. At least for rank one or two. I haven't reached the higher rank monsters yet, so... That's about as strong as I'm gonna get. Wow! That's actually pretty strong. Huh. Yeah, I don't really care about any of those, so I'll keep it on. Let's go up here, though. Because there's some chests. Mmm, chests that didn't really have much in it, though. Anyway, time to find this jerk and teach him a lesson. What the? A mystic? Doesn't look like one. Okay! Two more to go, people. Jeez, are we, are we... This, if I recall, this is only the fifth episode, too. I'm breezing through this. Yeah, I find, it, I find it sort of ironic that his is the one that I'm breezing through. Quite possibly the hardest one of them all to actually complete. But, uh, oh well. I shouldn't be complaining. I really shouldn't. <laughs> it just means I have to suffer through Riku. I mean, re Riki's even less. Unfortunately, these next two are going to be somewhat problematic. Despair. Hey, come back, Lisa. I want you in my party. Nope. I don't think so. See, Mei Ling is so stupid the way she handles things. If you talk to her in just the wrong way, you'll screw it up. Derg. Err. Very annoying. Um, did I forget to do something? Oh, so I didn't get to do that. Alright, now I got it. Ooh, boy. Now 
that must have been a lot of money. Interesting. Um, I don't really see the difference of, of bringing her with me, but whatever. I feel sorry for any plumber that has to do this. Oh, I see. She guides me. I think I went the wrong one. confused. Okay, I guess I keep backtracking then. There's only so much of that I can do though. Oh, here we go. The order of how you go into these rooms must be different for Riki, since I don't recognize this path as well. Granted, it could be just because I'm entering from a different area. I'm disoriented now. Oh, darn it. I wish he would stay on punch. But he likes to switch sometimes. Sliding. Oh, come on, man. Follow Mailing's example and learn something good. Oh well. Forget that. I am very, fairly happy with what I've got right now as a monster class. At least for the moment. Oh come on. That was just cheap. That is what I mean, though, about enemies having sporadic moving patterns. It makes it really hard to judge where to dodge them sometimes. And to be honest, it kind of irks me. Because I'm used to games where enemies follow precise patterns. But now when I'm playing a game that doesn't have them, I just get pissed off. Because I'm, uh, I'm constantly screwed over. This time we go up here, gotcha. Yeah, this is the alternate path. Am I done already? Now, again, in the Ultimania, they went into a little more detail about this. Apparently, the Warren used to be one of the members of the Secret Society of Heroes that was mentioned in Red's story. But, he did something he wasn't supposed to. Um, and they were supposed to kill him, but he begged for mercy. And instead of killing him, they sent him here for, a, for the rest of his life. And put a, however, they put a curse on his life to where he can't die. Sort of like the mystics, in a weird sort of way. So now he's, supp he's supposedly trapped here forever in this prison. Kind of mean.
And here's a little trivia for you. They pulled something similar in the Mega Man Zero series with the evil doctor, I forget his name. But they did try to do something similar to him, and it's kind of backfired on them and that one. But enough about that. The final ring. Yeah. This is honestly where all the hatred of me um, and Riku's quest comes full circle. This final ring is a pain in the rear, and you're gonna find out why. I'm not gonna beat it completely without beefing it up, because his he he fights the final boss right afterwards. But I will do some of it though. You can leave whenever you want. And boy, do they go out their way to make this almost impossible. Okay, we gotta talk to the Rain Lord here. Who, out of all the characters in this game, is one of the ones that annoys me the most. Keys of my spirit bird. This one may or may not take a few videos, and parts of it I may off screen completely just because of how long it's going to take. Bread. Okay, this one's not so bad. However, do keep in mind that most of the creatures here have a much higher rank than most normal areas are. Which, if you wait till you build up a lot, can be very annoying. Oh boy. However, it is good for building up techniques easily, since the more powerful the enemy, According to your stats, the faster you learn, you learn new skills. Oh, how ironic is that? Seriously? That, like, never happens. Another new gun technique. This time I'm not shocked. Please tell me it's two gun. Or at least bound shot. Two gun! Thank you. Oh, that's so good. You have no idea. Oh yeah, you can't quick save in here. I got a key. See, that one wasn't so bad. One of the battles in this place, though? Pain in the rear. Yeah, every time you get one of these wrong barrels, you fight a, you know, random battle. It's not so bad, though. I remember liquid metal being somewhat good. And I'm gonna check before I change anymore. As you can tell, I'm not I don't put a lot of emphasis in my monster characters because it's just too much work. And if you ever saw the fact for it, oh the way you have to use these monsters. So much work. Did I just see Bound Shot? Jeez, I should use her more often. Yep, Bound Shot. Well, I just got two of the best skills in the game for gunners right away. Oh yeah, check Reiki. Oh wow! Yeah, I like this. A lot.
getting rid of uh, tail. Not that I'll be switching anytime soon. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of battles in this one. That's okay though. As far as monsters go, Liquid Metal is, I think, what, the best rank 3 that I think you can get. I know it's close to that. I don't think it's rank 4 though. But if you do manage to get this guy, try to keep him around until, like, the very end, when the real strong ones start showing up. There's just one room in here that I swear I do not know what I'm supposed to do. It's like an invisible maze, labyrinth thing. Oh, I'm done. Huh, that was quick. Okay, that's two down. Oh. Cool, it does keep track of how many you've got. It's a good thing, too. Oh boy. I think these are the really bad ones, though. Oh yeah, this is the one I was talking about. I'm saving this for later. How about this one? Oh, here's a maze. Oh, snap. It's okay, though. These guys are nothing. Heck, I'd still be doing this rather than doing this stupid, uh... Um... Rat chasing scene. Which I swear, still, I'm still pissed off over that a little. That was just the epitome of cheapness right there. Yeah, I think if you get caught by those things that are rolling, you have to start over. Which can be fairly annoying, and these enemies are starting to increase in difficulty pretty quickly. That's not a good thing, since in that spike room you saw a moment ago, you have to fight a lot of battles. Oh, come on. You all need to focus on these two. That's not going to do any good. That's tempting, but I don't really want to lose him. Oh, come on, leave me alone. I don't want to get caught by him and have to start off. Oh, crap. Oh, yeah. Enemies are increasing big time. I need some better equipment. I might not be able to survive this, but holy crap. Okay, never mind. I'm good. Once again, tempting, but I don't know about that. Yeah, the, they get more aggressive the more of these things you press. Uh, what do I do now? 
At first, I'm all having an eye. Fine, I'll take you out. A living gun? Doesn't look too threatening. A living musket, excuse me. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. It's about time for this video to end. Let me see if I can. Figure out how to beat this room. Oh. You have to, you have to defeat the enemies, it seems like. Okay, fine, whatever. That's three down. Let me, uh, I guess on the next video we'll see just how many of these I'm going to be able to pull off before I have to build up some. See ya.